What's going on guys, everyone? Another video where we're going to talk about a bunch of random things interesting to me. In this video, we're going to be talking about some smartphones. And everybody's talking about the Samsung Galaxy S6 and the S6 Edge. And then they're comparing it to what Apple's doing with the iPhone 6 and iPhone 6 Plus. Apple and Samsung are basically copying each other. And I don't think they're copying each other in a good way. The platforms are a little bit messed up. You know, Samsung has this whole thing going on with Tizen. So right now, they have Android on the phones, and everyone's hyping up Tizen, saying it's going to be the next big thing. But meanwhile, nobody's really focusing on Tizen because Android is owning the mobile market. And yes, I own a Nexus 6, and I think it's the best phone out there, but that's besides the point. But when you look at what Samsung is doing with TouchWiz, and you see that phone, now they just announced that you can uninstall some of their crapware from the phone so you can just use it the way you want. I would say this, if you're a real Android fan, Check out a phone with just Android. No touch with none of that nonsense from HTC. Just go with what you like. If you like Android, check it out for what it's worth because I have to tell you, when I change to the Nexus 6, I don't care about the Galaxy phones. I don't really like Tizen. I'm not interested in anything with TouchWiz. And I think the whole idea of adding an edge to a phone for an extra $100 is a waste of money. And then when I look at Apple and what they're doing with iOS, a complete mess. Like I've always said on this channel, they are not doing anything innovative with that platform with the phone. And they have a lot to learn about mobile. Yes, they have a lot of fans who love the iPhone. I get it. People buy Apple products for various reasons, whether they like the product, but also they become fans of the company so it doesn't necessarily mean that that platform is the best especially when the whole market again is owned by Android it almost reminds me of the Yeezy boost Kanye West says you know what this is the most innovative sneaker out there and he throws a dish rag on someone's feet and he's calling it the coolest sneaker out there I just don't agree with it but you know what people are gonna copy it they're gonna say it's fashion and they're gonna sell the sneakers so when I went onto the Sprint website and I saw that it's an extra hundred dollars for an edge on the phone those people don't care. They just want you to buy a phone. If you really like the Galaxy phones, fine. Go buy yourself a Samsung Galaxy S6. Don't get the one with the Edge for an extra $100. Go spend it on something else that you'll like because that Edge is not gonna serve a lot of purposes. You're talking about what, sliding your finger and getting a list of contacts and that's gonna cost you $100? I don't get the point. And I think the people who work at Samsung, you gotta stop copying Apple. If Apple was the best at what they're doing with mobile besides the brand loyalty, I get why you would wanna copy them. But these are not the old days when the iPhone is just the only phone out there. You can do other things. Even when Apple was trying to do these different things with iOS and they were trying to make, I guess, a different experience that resembled Android, it's still not doing it. And it's a lot of clutter and it has a lot of mistakes in it and it has just a little bit of a lack of quality. And that's what I would say about iOS. And then with TouchWiz, it's the same kind of experience. It lacks quality. And if you ever use a Galaxy phone, you'll know what I mean. Then you gotta go use an Android phone that's just Android and you'll understand even better what an Android phone is supposed to be. So anyways, you guys can tell me what you think about it. You let me know what you think is the best phone on the market. Maybe I'll talk about it in my next video. And of course, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.